extended family, right? It's a wrestling family. And here's the 141. It's Jesse Mendez against Hunter Mason, a true freshman who is making his dual debut. So, like at 125, we say it is probably on paper a win by the All-American against a freshman or underclassman, but now we have Hunter Mason. What are we going to see against an absolute buzzsaw in Mendez? Mendez, a sophomore from Crown Point, Indiana, Hunter Mason. Down in Tennessee, said when he was prepping for Jesse Mendez, he doesn't usually watch a whole lot of tape. He's focused on himself going into this match in the 141. Wrestle out of it. Oh, nice, he went the other way. Oh my goodness, he, he did a throw by one side and then hopped to the other side to get the double. He had a front headlock, tried to throw it one way. When it was defended, he went the other side and got the takedown. Oh, that was so slick. I see Mendez strikes first, gets three on the takedown. Another look. He had just threw the throw by from the front headlock one way and then went the other way for the double. That's called chain wrestling right there. Mendez, a guy who's been good throughout his whole career. He won an Indiana State title every year he wrestled in high school. That was four. But right back to that front headlock. It just no relentless pressure. You see, he's going on and just continue to keep the pressure forward. Three take. Look, this is where these takedowns make a difference. Six one already. Six one. Escape at six two. Alternate here would be what? Four two, right? Much different. Much different. There was uh, uh, Mendez is looking good. He's looking good, and he's looking for a near fall here. He went to that single, and then he went to. Uh, kind of like a cradle, bellied out, and he he's really looking Red, you're sharp. In Jesse Mendez, 9-2, in control, three takedowns for the control sophomore Red. from Crown Point. Neutral, a couple one, of three. escapes for Hunter Mason making his debut here in Castle. Hunter Mason just, just he, he's not moving quick at all. Look at this. I mean, oh. Three, Red, takedown. Mendez is looking so good. I mean, this is a true freshman. First real dual meet, nerves, you just don't know. Sometimes you get lead in your feet. But he's going against one of the guys that looks like Mendez really expects to win a national championship. Up a weight, feeling good about himself. And look at this, running him over the top. Oh, look at this. They need a fall here. Look at this. He, he could get a fall. He's got that one left shoulder down. He's got to settle back. He's too high. Mendez needs to get chest on chest and settle back. Up. Four point near fall, 17 to three. Riding time up for Mendez, two above a minute. Sixteen to three. Arm bar looking for the half again, see if he's gonna roll it. I mean, we, we are watching just an absolute clinic. Stop. Stop, looks like we have blood. In, in college, there is no blood time per se. It's just blood time, meaning that there's not a clock that says you have five minutes like you do in high school. It's just the referee's discretion. Now, if there's, you know, blood all over the singlet, something different, but here, you know, just go clean it up. And Hunter Mason, he just went and gets a blood saw. I mean, it, Jesse Mendez is looking so good that Castle Coliseum is quiet. They're just watching yep. like, wow, this guy is really good. Well, Mendez, this past summer, he wrestled at 65 kilograms, which is at 143, different from 141. That was at the U-20 World Championships in Jordan. How different is that, the, the two pounds there? What kind of difference does that make? You talk to any wrestler, a half a pound means a lot. <laughs> a quarter of a pound is a lot. So, yeah, so he has world aspirations. It wouldn't make sense for him to try and hold weight at 133. Moving up to 141, to get ready for the international season. And I'm telling you, he's looking good at folk style right now. My goodness, he's no, looking good. No decision in the Clarion Open for him. Took second after the no decision in the finals. Back on top here of Mason with five seconds in the first. In that Clarion finals, it was his teammate. And they said, ah, we don't yeah. need to wrestle. No need to get injured. So. And Hunter, Hunter Mason, a true freshman, I, he's just getting overwhelmed right now. 
and uh, when you consider how good Mendez was out of college, and his run to become an All-American, he had so many tight matches which shows mental toughness and the ability just to improve, and now he's up a weight, looking really good. No red, no change. You make a good point, though. Hunter Mason still adjusting to that collegiate level. No matter what the result is, he'll remember his debut here in Castle. Actually roommates with Sam Latona. He said he learned kind of how to have that solid daily routine from him. Routine is very important. Yep. When I was uh, traveling and talking to other coaches, they talk about the importance of having a system routine. And there's no great athlete who isn't very disciplined and has a routine. Talking to Ohio State head coach Tom Ryan, he dropped just about every inspirational quote in the book. It was it was great talking to him. Just motivated me on a Monday afternoon. And all the years of experience, yeah, of, of coming from Hofstra, being a national finalist at Iowa, and now leading uh, these Ohio State Buckeyes. And one of the things he talked about was love. And, you, and I said, Coach, you know, you come from Iowa. What about that? He said, No, 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 no. You've got to show love to your to your wrestlers. And this is tight here by Mendez. But he said, you got to show love. You got to show your wrestlers that you love them and you support them. It's the ultimate battle sport, right? They're 18 to 22-year-olds in a 1v1 sport. It's all on you. That's what he said. It's a lot of stress. He said, don't let it turn into distress, which Absolutely. I love. And I tell you what, we talk about love, but Mendez is showing no love to Hunter Mason. No, right no, no. Look at chin back. Oh. Man, just, just. Mendez, a couple of takedowns. He's up 16-3. It was a domination in the first. Water finding its level a bit here in the second. Stepping through, getting swipes. Nothing yet. You got to break 45 degrees. There it is. Two swipes, three swipes. He's got three right now. Two near fall. He's holding it because... And now it's been awarded. And there is the 18 to 3 technical fall. I'm telling you what, Jesse Mendez looking good at 141. Looking really good. And Hunter Mason's first first match against an All American. He's going to learn. He's going to learn. Tech fall victory. Jesse Mendez keeps on rolling undefeated in 2023. Knocks off the true freshman, Hunter Mason. Here it is, our match to watch, coming up at the 149.